2021 Laquita. We made it. <laughs> we made it, Vic. We made it. We made it. It looked a little iffy there for a minute, you know, but <laughs> we made it. <laughs> Just a round of applause for everybody that have made for it. Sure. Y'all made it through for 2020. Sure. Um, some of y'all came up in 2020 for real, for real. And, you know, other people just just to be here healthy, safe, your people around you good. That's a victory enough in itself. So we're happy to have you here in 2021. Welcome to Create Your Future Self Live. I am Victor Vanico Johnson. I have my co-host is here, Laquita Monley. So how was your New Year's? <laughs> oh, Vic, my New Year's was good. It was good. It was good. I can't complain. I am blessed. You know, we, we made it into 2021. A lot of people have been begging <laughs> for 2020 to be over. But guess what? Congratulations. Your wish has come true. We at the top of the new year and looking forward to nothing but great things. And, you know, we say that all the time at the beginning of each new year. And I know for the world, a lot of people reflected on, OK, what is these things I said to myself was my quote, New Year's resolutions, my goals and all of this. Right. And then 2020 turned out to be real interesting. Um, but like you said, uh, we met so many people to where yep. regardless of what 2020 bought, they had a come up, whether mm -hmm. it was in their businesses, in their careers. Uh, but most of all, a lot of people um, changed the way that they think. They had a yeah. mindset shift that was more valuable than any other thing they could have gained because that mindset shift is going to take them into a successful lifetime and not just mm -hmm. a successful year. Yeah. Yeah, I would totally agree with that. I mean, no matter where a person was financially, physically, health wise, whatever, you know, you had to do some adjusting in 2020 okay. for sure. And, okay. you know, hopefully m most people found some creative ways to make it to maybe it came up with some ideas, some things that they could do to unify their family more. I know there obviously it was more time with your household because you quarantine with these folks. So hopefully <laughs> something positive came out of all of that. Yeah. But even more importantly, maybe you learn something about yourself in 2020, how you deal with adverse, how you adjust to things, you know, how, what's your bounce back game? Like, you know, when That's these true. type of things happen that you're not planning for. And yeah. what we want to encourage people is in 2021, how can you leverage that? How can you take that power, that new strength, that superpower that you might have dusted off from back in your day when you were already super powerful and you may have forgotten that you had that power, that skill? How can you take that in 2021 and do something absolutely magnificent for your life, for your family? And, you know, we talk about creating your future self. How can you build on that legacy from what you got out of 2020, you know? Mm -hmm. So hopefully, People have been thinking about that, jotting some things down. They already already know what their goals are for 2021. And now they're just trying to figure out, well, how do I make this come to reality? How, how do I bring it to fruition? You know, some, for some people that means you gotta do some more reading and research. You know, for other people, that probably means that you need to get your money together, maybe your credit together, you know? But the bigger thing is, do you need support in certain areas to get yourself over those humps or through those challenges that you don't even know about that may be on the forefront of that new uh, world that you're in. So I wanted to spend some time today, you know, Laquita, we talked about this, like we really don't spend a lot of time talking about how we're able to help our clients. And we all, we both have had, you know, several people and dozens of folks that we've helped out in our businesses, but we typically spend time on Create Your Future Self Live talking about our guests and what they have to offer and how they can you know, uh, share what they do and encourage and inspire people. So I thought it'd be a good idea. We talk about a little bit of how we help people. What you think? I think that's a great idea, Vic. I think that's a great idea um, because we do, you know, the, the whole point of Create Your Future Self Live is um, to give helpful information to people so that they can become the, the individual that they want to be moving forward. And we do, we, we offer some, some amazing services um, not only through this platform, but also in, in our own businesses individually. And I think it is important that we talk about this coming into um, 2021. We're at the top of the year, you know, and the things that we're able to do for clients um, is absolutely amazing. And that's one of the reasons why we're able to be um, successful even in this space 
through Create Your Future Self. So I think it is really important that we talk about it. But, you know, even as I'm reflecting back on 2020, um, we look at, I think the biggest word for 2020, other than COVID-19, <laughs> was pivot. 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 Yep. And that is what we, that's something that I, I have to say, you know, not to toot our horns or whatever, but that's something that we teach our clients all the time. And not just, not just people who are paid clients for us, but that's something that we talk about for free all the time. Yeah. The necessities of being able to pivot and in that also being able to tell your story. Yes, yeah. That's in order important. to be able to um, bring value to someone else. And those are the things I think that people who came out of 2020 with a different mindset and who were able to, um, to grow in 2020, those two things were things that they had to learn to embrace. The necessity yeah. of pivoting and the necessity of being able to tell my story and add value to others. Because Absolutely. let's let's be clear, 2020 was a time when we all needed to be encouraged. The yeah. whole world. <laughs> lift each other up. Lift Just each lift other up. Yeah. And, yeah, give me a hug. Give me something. <laughs> give me a word of wisdom. You yeah. know, and and I'm, I'm super proud that we're able to do that on a daily basis, day in and day out. And, and also that we're able to receive that from other people. Yeah. Uh, I think that's the key to a great leader, whether you are mm -hmm. a leader in your home, in your business, your job, whatever you are, in order to add value to people, we have to be great in leadership. But people who are great in leadership were once uh, great in uh, being a follower, being submissive to someone mm -hmm. uh, and taking that time to learn and grow and receive what they've learned. And, and that's what we're here to do. Somebody's pouring into us and we're pouring into people. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, I can recall two years ago around this time, back in January 2019, that's when we officially launched Create Your Future Self Live. And, you know, both of us very active real estate investors. And I think maybe you help refresh my memory. I think we initially started this out to kind of inspire those uh, up and coming uh, real estate investors. You know, it was one of those things to kind of share our story, some of the challenges we went through, and for people that were interested in real estate investing, you know, they could probably learn quite a bit from the stories that we were telling. You know, I'm pretty sure I'm on target with that, right? <laughs> you, you're, you're spot on, Vic, you're spot on. We, uh, we are both real estate investors and it was something that we wanted to do in order to bring value to people and, and to inspire many, not just in our community, but you know, across the globe, across the world, our viewers in general, um, that in order to get to where you want to be in obtaining wealth, getting rid of debt, all of these things to be financially stable, you must have real estate. And That's there right. are alternative ways by which you can obtain real estate. And yes, that was the, for the first what year and a half, for the first half of year that we did this, it was all about real estate. And mm -hmm. towards the end of that year, we started to bring in people um, that had different uh, areas of expertise, but it all could even still relate back to financial security. Everyone that has ever been a guest on our show, yeah. uh, the services they provide will help you get on that path to financial security. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Yeah. And so, you know, we we started out there and then again we've invited so many folks in and just have had some amazing stories of inspiration overcoming uh people you know finding victory within their own personal business journey or uh their own personal journey period right health journeys and all that so you know i think let's spend some time a little bit both of us again are real estate investors you know professionally this is how we eat this is what we do for a living and I think it'd be a good idea to kind of dive in a little deeper into how each of us individually work with folks to, you know, help them on their real estate investing journey, or in your case, uh, probably more so than mine, you know, how you're able to take those houses and help families get a better living situation by, you know, whether even when they have certain challenges, you know, going through M5 real estate solutions, they're able to still find livable homes, comfortable homes for their families and things like that. And so um, today we're going to toot a little bit of our own horn, you know, and, <laughs> and it's not from a braggadocious standpoint, but really to let you know what we hear, what we have to offer to you here. Um, and again, if you want to dig in for deeper support for individual, for each of us individually, you know, we want to be able to let you know how you can do that. And 
really start 2021 off right. You know, I know a lot of people have those New Year's resolutions. I, I prefer to call it a new day resolution. Every day I'm resolving to be something better and to, to be better than I was yesterday. And I want to okay. really encourage people that watch us, create your future self. Do what we're asking you to do. Go out and create your future <laughs> self. And so yeah. we just want to talk about some of the uh, services that we offer that will help you to accomplish that. So I don't know, you want to start? You want me to start? How you want to do this? <laughs> because we're so multifaceted, Vic, we can go on, we can talk about individual ones. So, but you know what, I'll, I'll, I'll start off and what I want to talk about, and I'll go ahead and do a quick screen share here. What I want to talk about first is um, my company, Monthly Innovations. Uh, Monthly Innovations is how one of the biggest moves that Ben and I made to come into that entrepreneurial space. And uh, the reason that I want to share this company first is because oftentimes, um, all the time, let me not say oftentimes, mm -hmm. all the time when you're shifting from W-2 to a 1099 or being an independent business owner, we want to ensure that we have a continual cash flow coming in to take care of us, right? Yeah. We have to take care yeah. of our families while we're growing our business. And this is something that my company, Monthly Innovations, definitely can help out. I, re I remember back in uh, 2016, we were getting ready to leave, preparing to leave Germany. And a good friend of mine here, her name is Alondra Merchant, she told me about the company that I partnered with in order to create Monthly Innovations. Mm -hmm. and, and it's through that partnership that we're able to provide work from home uh, opportunities to individuals across the United States. And now this is pre-COVID people, this is before COVID-19 was a thing. Right. Uh, here at Monthly Innovations, we were always we were always able to offer people work from home solutions, answering inbound customer service calls for some of the nation's leading companies. And, and as you can see here on the slide, um, on Mondays um, at 8 p.m., for those who have signed up and registered, we do an informal interview. It's a Q&A session. You wanna find out more about who we are at Monthly Innovation. You wanna know how to become a contractor. And this slide is old, I had to change it, it says 2020. But for 2021, you wanna know more about how to become an independent contractor. How can I shift from my everyday job to a work from home job? And what our agents can expect from us as a company. These are things that we talk about um, in, this informal, um, in this informal conversation. And those who want to move forward and partner with our company, we're more than happy to walk through the steps and do the actual interview process with them so that they uh, can come in and um, have an interview with us. You know, there's there's so many reasons now. It's like, I don't even have to talk to people about the importance anymore working from home. COVID helped that. <laughs> yeah, that was like free advertising right there. free advertising, right? <laughs> COVID was a blessing. <laughs> so, you know, in 2017, when we started 2017, 2018, even 2019, you know, it was people would call or fill out the online application and then we get in the interview process. And it's like at some point during the interview, the potential agent felt like they were interviewing me. And I'm thinking to myself, no, dear, I can't provide you with this. You know, <laughs> you know like I'm mean, like, you're not doing me a favor. I'm doing you a favor. We could collaborate together and be a blessing right. to each other. Yeah. Right. You know, right. my company grows. That's great for me. If you become a part of my company and through that you have an income coming in that you can control, that's great for you. So it's a, it's a relationship that works together. It's not a one-sided relationship. And so my most successful agents, they embrace that. They realize that because as a contractor, I can't tell you when to come to work when to go home and how long to stay. You mm -hmm. will agree to the terms of the contract and then how you fulfill it, that's on you. So our agents, they create their own schedules. They choose their own clients. Therefore, they have the ability wow. to control their income. That's the only awesome. Point. I mean, it's, it's such a blessing. And so many people um, have saw the value in that and partner with us, whether they are disabled, whether they're disabled veterans, spouses of, of active duty service members. We have a lot of, of um, full-time clergy members that do it where they're 100%, all they do is serve the Lord, but they still mm. have to have an income. You know, it's a lie out there in, 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 in the atmosphere that full-time pastors stealing all the money. No, they have to work jobs to take up and, and cover the space where people don't give because people believe that lie. 
but that's right. another that that's another subject for another day. So right. yes, I do have a lot of people that are in ministry that partner with us for that reason because people don't believe that they should give. You know, they have all of these yeah. misnomers about clergy, and it works perfect for them because with monthly innovations, what we feel is the most valuable thing that we bring to the table for our partners is we give them the ability to control their life. We hear about work-life balance all the time. Well, mm -hmm. we know that's not a real thing, but the closest thing that we can get to being able to provide work-life balance for our agents is giving our agents the ability to schedule their work around their life. Right. So now my, their life doesn't have to shift to suit their job, but right. they have the ability to make their jobs shift to wow. suit their lifestyle. And to me, that's the most valuable thing that we bring to the table. Man, that is definitely awesome. Cause you're right. There's this persona that being an entrepreneur, sometimes you don't have to work any other work, you know? And, and yeah, that's the goal is to get your business <laughs> to the point where yeah, it's, goals, right? it's supporting not only the business, but you and, and not only you, but the goals of, of saving and building the legacy. Right. I mean, cause you know, I'll be honest, you know, in my situation two years ago, my corporate job, went away. I released a book. I got severance though. Cause you know, I was over 40 and I'm black. So that two time, uh, protected class, I don't know if you want to just eliminate my position like that, but <laughs> so once we figured out that number, but it still was a situation where I was like, okay, I got this money. I'm investing to build my business. I got my rental properties and things like that, but you know, rent is rent. And I still have other things that I like to do. I like to, you know, we can raise, you know, take trips and stuff once the world opens back up and I want to still be able to save. Right yeah, you know what I'm saying? I'm out down right now. <laughs> yeah. So you don't want to have to diminish your lifestyle, your savings goals while you're building your business. And so I love this idea where you're saying at any time of the day, you know, mm -hmm. per, one of your contractors logs in, they, you know, have already selected maybe the contracts that they want to work, the clients they want to work, mm -hmm. and they just log in and Maybe they got something else to do later. They can log out and there's no penalty other than penalty. they just not making no money at that moment. Right. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So it's like they, once they pick the client, they go through the training. The training part is the only part that has a set schedule that's given to them by the company. Well, actually, it's by the trainer. So the okay. trainer you pick. So it's, let's say you pick a schedule and you have to um, be in class from 8 a.m. to 12 noon. It's not even an eight hour class. It's four hours a day. Okay. Or however long your class, however many weeks your class is. You do that training and it's live online. It's not at your own pace. You actually have accountability. Yeah. Okay. You're okay. on a session just like we will be on a face-to-face -face session that's screen sharing capabilities. Um, it's, it's everything you need to be successful and ensuring that you pass this course. And also there is a mock part of it where you're actually taking calls. Now, some companies is a mock call. Some companies you're really on the phone with their customers. <laughs> okay. So, and you were being monitored. So, you know, I've had to release some people where they thought that they could just come in and parlay and not do nothing. It's like, no, we know you wouldn't ever work. <laughs> right, right, right. You know, yeah. it, it's always somebody that's going to try the system. But by and large, most people are very, very honest. So the system works. Yeah. The system works. Yeah. Once they finish that training, at least once a week, new schedules are released. Mm -hmm. And you go into that scheduling system and you schedule yourself. Like you said, if I know that I got eight to 10 this morning, I'm free. So I'm gonna schedule myself for eight to 10, but then the rest of the day, I need to be at my children's school doing right. this, that, or the other. I need to go do my volunteer activity. I need to, you know, do some training and uh, take some classes because I'm taking online classes, whatever the case may be. And I know I'm not free to get back up to work anymore until say nine at night. If I'm working a client that has, that's open 24 seven. So I'm gonna mm -hmm. work the rest of my hours from nine to whatever for that day. You, you're totally free to do that. If something wow. happens in the middle of your shift and you have to leave, you're totally free to release that time that's and then nice. come back in and try to make that time up if it's hours available. Now, mm -hmm. the thing that I tell my agents is don't make it a, a habit. Don't become yeah. habitual with shifting and not working because every contract you have a certain amount of hours you have to work per week. And the work week is Sunday to Saturday. Okay. If your contract is 20 hours for that week, from Sunday to Saturday, at your pleasure, you fill that 20 hours. As long as it's within the company's normal business hours or their operating hours, you can do mm -hmm. that. 
right. and it's on you. As long as you're maintaining what we call, and you know this, Vicky worked at a call center, as long as you're maintaining your metric yeah, and yep. your QA accountability is good, you're good. Yep. Yep. Talk times, hold times, number of calls. Yep. Oh yeah. I remember yep. that all too well. Absolutely. Yes. As long so as how do they get in touch them. with you? If somebody wants to do this, what do they need to do? It's too easy. They can go out to my website at www.monthlyinnovations.com. Mm -hmm. We can also be found on most social media platforms. We're on LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Nice. So if you, if you go to Google, and you put in monthly innovations, we're gonna be the one, two, three, four, five, fifth, sixth option all the time. Go to Google. Google is your friend. <laughs> very nice, very nice. I love that. <laughs> now, this, now, see, this is what I'm talking about. This is adding true value to people, right? I mean, anybody can do this. You might be working a job and you need to find some extra revenue, you know, to to get ahead on those bills or yeah. you know, to start saving a little bit more. Maybe you got a goal to buy a house or get that first rental property in a few months and you want to start putting some extra dollars together, this is a great way to do it from your, your home, from your house, you know, log in Absolutely. and get to be, get busy on them calls. So I love this. This is dope. <laughs> that is sure. dope. For yeah, sure. so folks, reach out if you are looking for some work from home opportunities, contractor-based, so you, you, are, you are your own boss in this situation. Obviously, you got to work the system the way it's designed to work, but I love this. Uh, this is awesome, Laquita. This is really it dope. Thank you, Vic. And it's, it's monthly innovations is the one it's, you know, you do some things for money and then you do some things because it's your passion. Mm -hmm. Monthly innovations is by far my passion because especially for my military community, while my husband was active duty, the ability to work from home existed. I just was not aware of it. Wasn't something that was widely known about, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. If I had known about the ability to partner with the, with the company that I'm partnered with, so that I can work from home every time being got ready to PCS across America, it would have made a big difference because, because you do work from home, your positions are mobile. So where mm -hmm. the service member goes, the spouse has to go. And gotcha. you don't have to lose that income during that transition. You Man. get your, you go to where you're going, you get set up and you go right back to work. Yeah. Just yeah. like that, just like your service member would. They get that time off to make that transition and then they have to report in and they go to work. That's the yeah. same thing that we, that our agents are able to do. Now there are some states across the country where we, we are not able to hire out of those states. People cannot work in those states and it's only a few of them. Um, mm -hmm. But when someone reaches out to me and we're discussing, you know, the position, the criteria, all of that, that is one of the number one questions that we ask, where are you working from? Where do yeah. you live? Where will you be working from? And if you are in a state, where we're not yet at, then we'll have that discussion at that point uh, gotcha. about your ability to be able to move forward. Okay, now this is dope. I'm thinking about um, my youngest daughter, who's now, she's 23. Um, she is in the UK, you know, her husband's in the Air Force. He's deployed and she's actually pregnant, you know, so they'll have a baby this year, but she works in I guess the school um, in a school on base or something some kind of daycare yeah. or something It'll out there up. she won't be able to do that you know in a couple more months or so so this could be a great opportunity for her Absolutely. and again he's taking another tour at some point later in 2021 so no matter where they go she can still log so, in and do this work well for your daughter she's in a beautiful position because most people most service members that are people that move outside of the continental U.S. it's a no-go at that station for them. Mm -hmm. however Germany and England are a part of our community. Okay. So okay. she definitely, okay. she definitely can, you know, uh, Very nice. like I said, it, had I known something, we were in Germany and we were in England and I could have still been doing this, but yeah. I didn't know. There you go. Well, I didn't know until. No <laughs> we one has had to battle, right? Back. Yeah. And yeah. We don't know. We don't know, <laughs> but that's why we're here to share this information with you. Thanks for sharing that, Laquita. That is awesome. And again, Monly Innovations, Google it. You'll find them online on social media. Get out there and, and take action. That's what this is all about, taking action on information you. that you are uh, provided. So that's good stuff. That's good stuff. Um, all right, well, I'll tell you about, uh, for sure, a lot happens on the Nico Don Project side of the world, but uh, this last year and a half, we put a lot of effort and emphasis into a teaching platform uh, mm -hmm. called Proven Pathways Academy. And at Proven Pathways Academy, 
Uh, that's where I have some online courses on teaching people real estate investing, you know, basically helping them avoid a lot of the headaches that I've made in my first couple rental property deals that I was doing. Um, also, some things to help people that may have credit as a challenge. They want to get to that real estate investing. They want to buy a house. They want to start a business, but they kept running into challenges with their credit somewhere along the way. We're getting the financing. So we've got some opportunities there. So I'm going to share real quickly my screen to kind of go into Proven Pathways Academy um, and just kind of show what we're doing with this program, how we're able to help some people. And, you know, everything that I do is definitely tied into helping people create their future self. So these programs and now that people are getting more and more comfortable with actually learning online, this is a great platform for people. So Proven Pathways Academy, a lot of the information in here is based on the book, Proven Pathways to Wealth and Happiness. I just took principles that helped me in my life to overcome a lot of my financial challenges, credit challenges, and really put me on a uh, pathway to building true wealth through the real estate world. So again, I'm a business coach for entrepreneurs, real estate investing. Um, my big bag where I really love um, is focusing on financial literacy. When I'm speaking in colleges and the high schools, whether it's now virtual or in a classroom, we focus on teaching kids the importance of the time that they have. You have age, a younger age. So if you get the concepts of starting to save money now, it's a great, great wealth builder for you. So that's what we do here again. I'm a financial wellness mentoring company. We help you create your future self. And this is accomplished by helping people improve credit scores, visualize their goals, and teaching how to build true generational wealth, whether again, that's entrepreneurship or real estate investing. So we do have some courses out there that people have already been taking advantage of. This is one of my core offers, the how to purchase your first rental property in 90 days. And that program is offered with or without direct coaching. So for some people, you know, I guess the benefits are, you know, some of the five keys that I've found to be successful when I'm doing buy and hold uh, real estate deals, how to find the properties, how to screen the property, uh, the tenants for those properties. It's a whole layout of things that I didn't really get through the coaching program that I even went through, um, but I learned some things along the way. And so if you just want the course itself, the video, it's about an hour worth of real estate co uh, videos in there and some downloadable documents, check by a uh, step-by-step guide on do this. Okay, you finish that, all right, do this next. So it makes it really easy for uh, the novice in the real estate investing world, but everybody's not able to learn just from watching videos and reading documents. So if you need the extended support, you want access to me and you know maybe a team member that can help you when you run across those road bumps. We do have an executive coaching program, fourteen ninety seven a month for three months. This is a super deal because once you get this deal up and running, you know I, in my first deal, Laquita, um, after I got refinanced in that first rental property, we were cash flowing five hundred dollars a month, and I was on that first door. When we refinanced it, we were able to pull some cash out helped us get the next property going. That one we were cash flowing, you know, $400 a month on. You know, at one point we had seven doors and on average they're pulling in three to $400 a door. You know, that's $2,500 a month in sure. your sleep, you know? Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> it's still work. I was still working 50 something hours a week in a corporate position, but I'll wake up on the first of the month, check that phone, <sighs> glory to God. Let's go to work. You know, feel good. Feels good. <laughs> it's a great feeling. So, yeah. you know, again, we talk about mentoring and investing in yourself. You know, don't look at what something may cost. Look at the return you can get from those things. Right. And so really proud of this course. We've been able to help um, in 2020. I only had like five clients come through there, but they completed it. But every one of them got their rental property up and running. And now, you know, they're happy, successful, moving on. Yeah. Got a credit course as well um, that, you know, this one is just a video course, basically gives you some educational tips on how to remove inaccurate or unfair items on your credit report that are usually the items pulling your credit scores down. Um, also, how to negotiate with collection agencies. I spent 17 years of my life in the call center world managing collection agencies. Uh, unfortunately, a good chunk of that time, my credit sucked and I was you know living at contradictory life. I'm teaching people how to collect debt, 
but wasn't managing my own that way. But I learned so much in that world, how the collection agencies negotiate with people, what's their motivation. And so I share a lot of that in those videos. It's only 297 for that. This is a budgeting course. So again, Proven Pathways Academy is something I'm really excited about and proud, proud to share with people. Um, I even included a couple other subject matter experts, a, a mortgage banker that I trust, and, and he's done great things for a lot of families, a lot of uh, you know black and brown families that don't always get the fair shake dealing with mortgages. So he laid out some things on how to get your loan package together, what you need to be doing to prepare for that, that successful loan approval. And this is for a real estate investor. So it's not just for your primary home, but how do you leverage conventional lending um, for a mortgage uh, for a real estate investment? Obviously, there's tons of creative ways to do it. And we, we both can share on that aspect of it as well. Um, but this is what we're really proud of. And in 2021, we really want more people to be able to get easy information, accessible, it's user friendly. Um, you know, you can see it up there. The teachable platform is super, super uh, user friendly. Um, so there will be more courses being uploaded throughout the course of the year. But this is one of the ways that um, Nikodon Projects and myself are able to really help people to create their future self, get to that bag in 2021, uh, which ultimately leads to a happier family, a happier life, and just more you feel better about yourself when you have overcome some of those financial challenges and when money and credit are no longer holding you back from something oh, wow. woo, life changing <laughs> life changing yes, it yes it so is. Yes. really excited about this program so if anybody has questions or wants to dig in everything is already set up if they you just click the link you jump you're already enrolled we got it so user friendly and again if you want the um executive coaching, it gives you an opportunity to schedule the call with a consultant to start going through and setting up your, your cadence for your training. But super excited about that one. And uh, 2021, again, big things are coming down the pipes for, for us and for those that get involved with us. Absolutely. I mean, 2021 is, for me, 2021 is just a different, I'm at the next point in my roadmap to success. And that's what I tell my clients. You're just at the next roadmap. You're at the next point and your roadmap to success. It didn't matter about 2020, it's gone. Yeah. Let's look at 2021 and let's steamroll ahead. You know, and to be honest, even in our last, um, in our last live, you may mention that it, they should have already been planning for 2021. Oh, yeah. And honestly, uh, this time in 2020, our clients were already looking at 2021. So those that are connected to us, and, and to be fair, I didn't even learn that in my entrepreneurial space. I actually learned that in ministry. <laughs> wow, okay. I prepared a calendar for the next year. Yeah. So if I, we're in 2021 now um, in most ministries, especially if they're of a sizable size or if they have partners uh, across the country and other countries, they plan at least two years out. Yeah. They plan at least in understanding you don't know what tomorrow is going to bring. So you have to be ready to what? Pivot. You have to be ready to make that necessary adjustment. Some things will come off the calendar. Some things will go on the calendar. Challenges will happen and you have to make the adjustment. But we have to, you know, they learn that in the military. To make the necessary adjustment, keep moving. And that's what on. we do. Keep yep. moving. We're, we're planning out. Now mm -hmm. it's just time of execution. That's it. Take that's action. It. Take Don't action. sit on your hands, waiting <laughs> on somebody to save you. Ain't nobody coming nobody's there ain't no help coming until you start taking advantage of helping yourself um i think it was dl hugh it was a comedian or something i watched i listened to one day and he said uh you know it was a man on the side of the road sitting in his car flat tire and cars just flying by just zipping by zipping by but the one guy who got out the car and started working on the tire to fix it himself everybody stopped him why is that? Because they see he's already taking action to try to That's fix right. his problem. They want to help him mm -hmm. fix the problem. They exactly. don't want the person sitting in, well, so somebody sooner or later going to come and help me change this tire out. And you sitting in the car listening to the radio and eating chips and ain't nobody coming. Nobody's yeah. coming. They don't know you're in, in trouble. <laughs> they don't know you need help. So take action, start doing stuff and watch how the world just opens up for you. 
the opportunity that you're looking for, the support that you need, it will attract to you. You don't have to worry about that. You just got to get laser focused on what you want and really lock in mentally. Your words, your mind, your actions need to be in alignment with what that goal is. I assure you, you don't have to worry about whether or not you'll get the support you need. It will attract to you just like a magnet. You're absolutely right, Vic. When you start moving forward and executing things, even if the execution doesn't go off the way you wanted it to, Mm -hmm. people are watching, whether you know they're watching or not. You Mm -hmm. being the best version of yourself that you can be by trying to execute your goals, execute Mm -hmm. what you need to to get to your goals, people Mm -hmm. will come to you. I mean, we've had so many guests to, to come on, create your future self where you or I have met them in passing or whatever. And we um, we didn't necessarily have it in our mind that we were gonna partner with. We just love what they did. Right. And right. They, by the end of the show, the energy there, we were partnering with them in some shape, form or fashion. You see, that's it. They, you know, it works. That, <laughs> it works, it works, it works. People want to work with, and they want to help people who are trying to help themselves. Yeah. That's, that's yeah. what they want to do. And, and and that's one of the, that's another key thing that, that the, the ability to execute without letting discouragement overtake you. Be, mm. I'm not going to lie and say the discouragement won't come because that's yeah, a lot. It's coming. It's coming. It's coming. But the ability to have that discipline to push forward. I was, I was going to brunch today. A friend, of, a really good friend of mine. Uh, she's actually a former client of yours. Um, okay. I showed her last night and uh, of a book that Ben and I wrote, and I have the first copy of it right now. Nice. Um, and she took me out to brunch to celebrate, and she asked the question, how do you find the discipline to do what you do? After I finished laughing. <laughs> 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 you know, uh. it, it, the simple answer to that is it's not a magic formula. No, I the way I find it in me is going to be the way different from the way you find it. Yeah, but you have to know that the discipline is already inside of you. You just have to tap into it to do it. That's right. My um my pastor defines discipline like this: the ability to say no when you want to say yes, or the ability to say yes when you want to say no. <laughs> That's <you> discipline. <laughs> just because I'm doing it don't mean Very I want well to. <laughs> Very well said. I like that. Wow. And it was, it's hilarious when you think about it, but it's so true. It's it's so very true. We Mm -hmm. have to have that discipline, dig deep. And it's just a matter, it's here. Mm -hmm. It's here. Mm -hmm. It's in that mind. It's my mindset, my mindset. But what, what you have on the screen here, Vic, is what is me and Ben's first book? (laughs) <laughs> this is awesome i yeah. love it the yeah. class, virtual physical all of the class coming yeah, nice. yeah. <laughs> oh that is but, beautiful but it's so excited so amazed um and so just transparent moment i'm writing a book but it has nothing to do with real estate i've been working on it for a while okay um and i we joined a mastermind uh, in 2020, we joined the mastermind. Okay. And it was for real estate investing and how to grow our business, how to grow and scale it, how to let people know more about who we are and what we do, how mm-hmm. we can be you know, a service to others. And yeah. in that group, in that mastermind group, writing a book about your business. Wow. Wow. Was at the That's... top of our to do list. Like we yep. had a challenge, we had deadlines that we had to meet other yeah. people holding us accountable for these things. And to be fair, Vic, as long as we've been real estate invested, I never thought about the necessity of writing a book about it. Wow, how about that? It never crossed my mind until we joined this group. And being, we had been were like, what in the world? I'm not gonna lie and say my first initial thought was, oh, I'm excited because that would be a lot. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah, yeah. It don't always look exciting in the beginning, yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't. But the more we worked through that process, the more excited we became. So yesterday we received the very first copy for us in the mail. I'm super excited. We went out today to celebrate and I'm so, you know, it's just 2020. 
Yeah. Has been a blessing to my house. Oh, yeah. Did some bad stuff happen? Absolutely. But in the midst of those roadblocks that come your way, you mm-hmm. cannot stop moving forward. No, no, you, you can't. You gotta keep moving. I am super, super proud of you guys, man. That is a huge, huge step. And it's, I see the name of the book. It's, a, you know, who don't want to buy or sell a house uh, right now? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, the real estate game is insane. It's insane. From the, you right know, now. you would think it would have took a dip, but in 2020, mm-hmm. you know, refinances were up 124% year over year. Sales are up. It just ain't even hardly no houses out there now, you know? So nope. it yeah. is definitely... It is definitely in the favor of the seller at this moment. You know, you got a, you got gold in your hand. <laughs> That's it. That's it. So I'm yeah. glad you got this book out. This is gonna help a lot of people. Wow. So yeah. when will it be released? So yeah, it'll actually be released later on this month. Um, okay. We're just working out the final final details of it, and it will be in paperback as well as in. Um, It'll be in on Kindle. It'll be in an ebook form. Okay. So oh, so we need to get uh Laquita and Ben Monley scheduled for an interview to talk about the book on the show. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the beauty of having this platform. Yeah, you can control your own schedule there. Yeah. <laughs> true, 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 true. It's yeah. very true. We that's will, um, awesome. But we'll definitely come on and, and talk about the book. I mean, and right now, like the book is titled How to Sell Your House Fast. But there are things in here that are not only for the homeowner, but it's also things that are in here also for the potential investor. If you're a new investor or if you're not a new investor, um, I love looking at things from other investors because I don't know it all. Yeah. There's yeah. no way I know it all. And yeah. I always learn something from someone else that I can implement into what I'm doing. Or if they're doing the same thing I'm doing, but they're more successful at it, let me see where my tweaks need to be. Mm-hmm. And that's something mm-hmm. that we have here. Um, unfortunately, investors have, you know, depending on who you're talking to, or where you are, sometimes we have a bad rap. And not every investor is like that, right? right. We are really right. here to be a blessing to people. Mm-hmm. Um, and this book, it does speak to that homeowner who wants to sell and needs to sell fast, but may or may not have the resources that it would take to say, have your wife listed. Because mm-hmm. We run into that a lot. Most of the people we help have that situation. Okay. They have a beautiful property, or maybe it's not so beautiful, but they need to sell it. Yeah. Whether they need to sell it in two weeks or in six months, they need to sell it. And they've tried the traditional route and they just don't have what is necessary to list the property and sell it. Okay. And mm-hmm. this talks about some of the things, you know, and I think sometimes maybe I'm too honest of an investor, uh, to be fair. Um, but if I walk into a property and I know it's retail worthy and the person just doesn't know that, what the little tweaks they need to make in order for it to be listed, yeah. Ben and I will tell them yeah. yeah, and give them the option. This is the realtor that we would connect you with, talk to them. This is what you can do, a few little tweaks to sell your property. Or if you don't do the tweaks, this is about what you can sell it for this will be your take home. If it works for you, list it. If it mm-hmm. doesn't, come and see me. Yeah. There you know, you because go. as investors, we're not going to give you full asking price. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We're not, it's not going to happen. It's, just, it's not going to happen. <laughs> so when you're dealing with us, it's better. I found that it's better to be honest and transparent yeah. than not to be. Uh, yep. Because when we do that, whether we buy that person's house or not, they always refer us. There you go. They always refer us so our business doesn't suffer. And this is really just a print version of some of our practices. Mm -hmm. I love it. Again, super proud of you guys. That's a big deal. Folks out there that are are in this space, like looking to sell their house or need to learn from a real estate investor, period. They need to get a copy of this book, m5propertyinvestors.com. Yeah, I like that. Yep. Good stuff. So I would assume some of these concepts will work beyond central Texas and Mississippi. It will, it will, it will. Uh, We titled the book because it was based off of things that we've done in central Texas and in Mississippi. On the next book, it'll be a little broader. The the title will be a little broader because we're definitely looking, um, we're looking to expand right now. We're working on a partnership 
um, a relationship with a fellow investor out in Arizona. Yeah. We used to live in Arizona. Uh, we mm -hmm. still have good friends that live out there. And we're right. looking at the mobile home space out in Arizona. And that's going to be the next move. And it'll probably be yep. the next book. <laughs> For sure. For sure. Constant elevation. Constant, constant elevation. Constant, that's like what it, it's all about. We've got single homes, single family homes, and we've got mobile parks. Yeah. And a mobile park. Go. Never thought go. to write a book about it. And it's that's what happens when you are in network with people, when mm -hmm. you're getting wisdom from people, when you connect it with coaches. This, this whole mastermind group is a bunch of, successful real estate investors yeah. who are simply chomping at the bit to share their wisdom with those of us who want to learn and wow. they taught me something in writing this book so mm -hmm. yeah there will be a book number two <laughs> again it comes out to you know circling yourself around the right people that are are uh, like-minded with focusing on growing their 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 selves their wealth their their legacy for their family but putting yourself in that environment where you can grow and you know the old saying, if you're the smartest person in the room, you're in the wrong room. You've you got room. to get around some people that can expand you, that can make you uncomfortable. But yeah. that uncomfort makes you grow. And that's yes. how you get to the life that you really want to be. So super again, proud of you guys. I can't wait to have you guys on. I already know Ben is is, is <laughs> ready, ready to start promoting this day. I can't wait to get him on the show to start messing with him a little bit. Up. <laughs> He's so ready. He's so ready. It's like you know, we've been thinking about 2021 for a long time. And with the shifts that happened in 2020, it's mm -hmm. like, no. Yeah. 20, we've got to come bigger and better and more consistent yep. in 2021 to keep things going. And this book, this book spiced it up. <laughs> oh, man, that is too cool. It up, you know, yeah. preferably, uh, preferably uh, the next book. And the, the second book, Ben is going to write some of it, but most of it is mine. Um, okay. uh, and this book is simply going to talk about our journey mm. it's mm -hmm. going to discuss our journey um, mm -hmm. and yep. from beginning to now yeah. and really we, we, with this book what, my, what I want to share with people is what a lot of other people have shared but most importantly the importance of not letting other people define your success mm most important that's my uh, that if nobody takes anything else away from this second book is that's what i want them to take away who or what is defining success for you and take that power back that's, that's it. take that power back i yeah. love that i love that well good stuff um as we wrap up i just want to um kind of just share you know my last little slide here just because there might be some folks that do want to reach out for other opportunities um, to, to get some help, whether it's a credit side or whatever. So I'll just share kind of my basic little contact slide. But um, these are the things that, you know, me individually and through my company, I'm able to, to kind of offer. I'm a certified credit consultant. Um, no, I'm not the guy. And at least I used to be the guy that was playing out dispute letters for you. I found a much more efficient way of doing things now. Uh, and so we just put together a credit action plan for people based on their FICO score, not your credit karma. And if you don't know the difference, reach out to me. That's the first lesson I'll teach you. But, yeah. um, you know, get, we, we go in deep dive, look at the FICO score. And what a lot of people don't realize is all the different changes that happen with the credit scoring models out there. You don't know what you're supposed to be doing hardly anymore. Obviously, you know, to pay your bills on time, but certain behaviors trigger drops in your score. And you're like, well, I thought that was going to help me. And it actually is opposite. So um, I leverage my expertise as a certified credit consultant, which means I have so tons and tons of hours of research in this industry, in this field, to where I can help people overcome those credit challenges. So we pretty much put an action plan together. And it's not a monthly subscription. You pay a one-time fee for the action plan. 24 hours later, you have a blueprint. And then I include two consultation calls with that. So that helps a lot of people, especially if you're just trying to get a quick 40, 50 points so you can refinance, pull out some equity. Um, you know, the things have changed in the last year because the banks are now a little bit scared because mm -hmm. of the uncertainty in the, the employment world and all that kind of stuff. So yeah. credit consultant, obviously a real estate investing consultant and entrepreneurship. I do a lot of that through, through the uh, Proven Pathways Academy. 
But the big thing is my book, Proven Pathways to Wealth and Happiness. You can get a free copy of the ebook. Visit my website, nicodimeprojects.com. Uh, first banner that pops up will give you an opportunity to download a free ebook copy. Or if you want to order, you know, paperback, you can go to Amazon or, you know, buy one off of the website. Cut out the middle, man. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> cut out yeah. the middle, man. But more importantly, I just want to really continue to be an inspiration to people. You know, I am a public speaker. Um, I get paid to speak in places. I have now created a virtual platform to do it and still get the same or similar impact. You never can replicate the energy of being in the same room with people, but we try to deliver the same engagement uh, as close as possible and definitely the information. So, you know, this is what I do. Please follow me, you know, Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn. And of course you could visit nicodonproject.com. You can always visit the services page to understand uh, the pricing and the terms and things of how we're doing what we do. But 2021, again, as my man, John Mack would say, 2020 wonderful. That's what I'm calling <laughs> this year. 2020 wonderful. wonderful. It is going yes. to be a wonderful year. We hope that we can continue to inspire you. Again, invite your friends to come on 6 p.m. Central Standard Time every Monday. We're here. Create your future self live to share more inspiration, bring in more guests to share their story and, and share little nuggets that you can walk away with and immediately implement into your life for the betterment. And so hopefully we've been a positive impact to the community and folks that have been following us. And we just can't say thank you enough for the people that have been in there. You know, folks been following us the last couple of years and I'm just super humbled by it and just appreciative and want to say thank you. Absolutely, absolutely. you spot on Vic. For those of you who are uh, our regular followers, thank you so much uh, for your support across that. We're going into what, year three now? This. Well, this will the third one. There we go. The yep. one, so. 19, 20, and 21. That's it. That's it. So thank you guys so much for your continued support. Um, we actually look forward uh, to being to engage with you guys each Monday. And for those of you, if this is your first time or maybe you've watched us one or two times, we, we really appreciate that your support as well. Please continue uh, to, to set those notifications and know mm -hmm. when we're coming on every Monday at 6 p.m. Uh, Central Standard Time. Like and share our videos. Let's get this information out to as many people as possible because truly we're here to be a blessing to others. And also, if you're interested in becoming one of our guests, mm -hmm. drop us an email at createyourfutureself at gmail.com. We love to hear from you. You know, there's no way we can reach any and everybody who has value to add, but we're interested. So reach out to us. Uh, if you're interested, and you forget the email address, when you connect with us on social, send us a DM and we'd be yep. more than happy to get you the link, to get you the information you need so that we can get you on the show and to learn more about who you are and the services that you provide. There we go. Couldn't yeah. wrap it up any better than that. <laughs> Good well, stuff. Well, folks, we'll see you again next week uh, at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time, Monday evening. We look forward to sharing again, more inspiration and go out there and create your future self. Awesome, awesome, thank you.